My name is John Ingram, and this is my presentation on Claude Monet for Art 111. About Claude Monet. Claude Monet was born Oscar Claude Monet on November 14th in 1840 in Paris, France. He attended several highly academic schools. He was a famous French painter whose work gave a name to the art movement, Impressionism. Impressionism is concerned with capturing light in natural forms. His work can be seen in museums around the world. Claude Monet died on December 5th of 1926 in Giverny, France at 86 years old. Why I chose Claude Monet. I chose Claude Monet because I have heard his name, but never really knew that much about him or his work. Only knew of one of his art pieces, but actually didn't know it was his until looking through the Art 111 book. So I took this opportunity to learn more about his life as well as his artwork and how it has influenced the world. Claude Monet's style period was based off of three main points, Impressionism, Modern Art, and Realism. His work was mostly done in the Impressionist style. Impressionism is a style or movement in painting originating in France in the 1860s. It is characterized by a concern with depicting the visual impression of the moment, especially in terms of the shifting effect of light and color. The style of Impressionism meant that color and the light that created it were at the forefront of the image. Human figures and epic tales took a back seat in the manner in which the sun or the moon bathed objects in different types of light were of key importance. His work would also be classified as modern art. Modern art is an art in which the traditions of the past have been thrown aside in a spirit of experimentation. Some of his work also fits the realism category. Realism sometimes is called naturalism, and that is when the artist attempts to present the subject matter realistically. What influenced Monet? In the beginning of Monet's career, he had several influential figures and mentors that taught him techniques that would be a major key in developing his own style of art. Some of the artists influenced his style are listed below. While Monet was 18, he pre he perfected his talent through charcoal caricatures. He didn't start painting with oil until he met Bowden, a famous French painter. It is this notable technique that started Monet's career. Monet's early style can be readily seen in his first recognized painting, Camille, also known as Woman in the Green Dress or The Woman in the Garden. Claude Monet's medium style, his main mediums were oil and crayon. The subject of his art was mostly figures, landscapes, and scenery. One of Claude Monet's most famous uh, artworks is the Impression Sunrise. The Impression Sunrise, created in 1872, is one of his most notable works, and is also the piece I have chosen to focus on. In this piece, Monet's impressionist style and brushing can be seen completely. The piece itself is a painting of the poor at Le Havre in France, and Monet's fast brushstroke is used to show the sun's reflective power on the calm, dark sea. The main unmistakable decidedly painted frame in the work is the, the dynamically orange sun and, the every, and everything else picks up or loses consistency, relying upon a separation from this beam of light. I chose this piece because my great grandma actually had a replica of this painting in her house before she passed away. So when I saw this, saw that this piece of art was in the book, I immediately knew that I wanted to do it because when I was little, I used to ask a bunch of questions about it and no one in my family could ever answer them. So I thought it would be interesting to look it up and answer them for myself. Claude Monet had, had motivation. His mo motivation was because he understood what life was about and the meaning of it, as well as he understood the meaning of painting. He was motivated to combine these two in, the, these two into beautiful works of art for people to try to understand too. Was Claude Monet a successful artist? Many of Monet's work did provide him with some financial success. He also experienced critical success during the late 1880s and 1890s when the public began to value his work. He started the serial paintings for which he would become well known even though he was considered a successful artist, he struggled with depression poverty and illness. Most of his life, it was shocking to me that one of his paintings, The, Gain, the Grain Thread, recently sold for $81.4 million. When comparing it, comparing it to his other work, this one seems fairly simple. 
the importance of Claude Monet's work. Monet's style was key to the Impressionist movement, as the artist's main focus was to portray color and light in the even more ingenious ways. He thrived to depict this element of art that took him as far as the Mediterranean Sea and various locations in Central Europe. The result of such exploration was the birth of an artistic movement that is still greatly admired today. Interesting facts about Claude Monet. Although you couldn't tell or wouldn't be able to notice in his paintings, Monet was depressed throughout the majority of his life. The word to describe the movement Monet belonged to, Impressionism, was meant to be a negative word. Another interesting fact is that Monet he also suffered from cataracts. However, just like depression, it wasn't noticeable in his work. Oddly enough, Monet liked lilies so much that he had them imported from around the world and had someone to even dust them off for him. One of the most interesting facts to me was that he, he was so mad at one point in his life that he decided to jump off of a bridge and survived it. That experience must have affected his art. I have enjoyed my study on Claude Monet and look forward to many more.